right, all right, all right, all right, all right. So, I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. I'm back again. So, I've been wanting to do this video a long time ago. Been, been wanting to do this video a very long time ago. And um, it's all about my, they call it now, my Mexican trip. I was supposed to do this video, but I've been so busy doing all sorts of things. Don't even know what, you know, what to, when I was going to do it. But eventually, now is the time that I get the, the chance to do it now. Since me, you know, Sunday year and thing and tomorrow me I go out. I go back out on the road tomorrow. So let me, let me get straight to the matter now. So my trip to Mexico. When, I, when my um, luggage get left behind. Listen now. So, I was on the plane, board the plane. I board the flight and I was wondering, everybody was wondering why the flight is taking so long. But, before I reach on the flight, before I reach on the plane, let me say something to you. I noticed something that was unusual. Can you know normally, when you go at American Airline, at the desk, soon as you check in your, your bag, your luggage, they would put it on that belt and it would uh, slide off and go around the back. Notice all that, all right? Never, ever, I never, I never, what I should say now? I noticed that that the, the belt wasn't working. But I, you know, you know, you're just wondering why they putting up all these suitcases. You just probably probably they might just put it one time and just put everything on the on the on the um on the belt and send it around. Alright. That never gone. So we board the flight after we board the flight. So when we board the flight now. I was sitting there wondering what's the problem. We realized that one second there. Yeah, so we realized that why the flight was so long, you know. I wonder what the problem. So here comes the guy from the front decks. Come on the plane and he said, Oh, um, guys. Some of you luggage, some, some of you guys' luggage did not made, make it on the flight. I said, what? I said, dang. Knowingly now, you know, I'm flying from Charlotte International Airport to Orlando to catch a flight to go to Mexico. Remember that now, you know? Catching a flight to go. To Mexico. So we land at Orlando. It's a connected flight now. No? Land at Orlando. It's not an American airline. Let me change it again. It's not an American airline. Spirit. So there's a um, there's a, a spirit flight leave from here to go to Orlando. They will catch an American airline. So when you get to Orlando, there was no luggage. <laughs> Say, wow, what is this now? So we go baggage claim and tell them the situation and say to them, say, look here, we're going to Mexico, you know. Six to seven days. So remember now, you know, me only have the clothes on me have on. That's all me have on and my backpack. And the shoes on me have on. No toiletry, no roller, no nothing at all, no extra, nothing at all. Boom, that's the only thing. Everything on my Avan, that my Avan. Them say with the luggage never made it from Charlotte. Say they are Charlotte, sit down. All right. We finally reach Mexico. Still no luggage. When we reach Mexico, them say the, 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 the luggage might come the other day, the, the next day. Never come. See, we have to end up go by. Give thanks to Walmart. 
Always I go say that. Give thanks to Walmart. Because you are me now. Walmart was nearby in walking distance. So when we get there, I bought a pack of white t-shirt, which is five. I bought a Crocs. I bought some white marinas. Them call it wife beaters. Whatever they want to call it. Now I got to debate about that. Buy two shots. And that was for my whole entire trip. It wasn't for my whole entire trip still. Because we were planning and waiting for the luggage to come within two days. Two days pass, it not come. Three days pass, it not come. Remember now, now six days, I do one week, you know. So on the fourth day, they send an email and say they're going to send out the luggage. You tell me now, the fourth day, we only have two more days. Why would I want them to send my luggage come all the way to Mexico? Knowingly, I am leaving within two days. Then the luggage doesn't serve no purpose. All if for three days, it don't serve no more purpose to me no more. Okay? So, when we check, luggage them there all under sit down all this time and you want to tell me sir four days now spirit come on do better than that spirit four days now you want to send back the luggage them to me now for come to mexico me don't need them no more you can't kick them with them out so send them an email call them and tell them so look here you can what you want you then close back the door yeah, that's my little chub maker. Yeah, let me lose all that, you know. So, me, me, you know, you know, when you look now, them say that them can send. No, 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 we don't need no send them. Make them stay right, send them back to Charlotte. So, when we come back, we receive them. So, them do, them send them back to Charlotte. When them send them back to Charlotte, and reach back to Charlotte, then they so receive them. You will tell me now, spirit, why would you want to send my luggage them? For me, come get them in four days on my vacation when, when me already gone through half of my vacation already. If it was one day, I could have saved it or two days. But three days, four days, no. I don't think I need them no more. So, send them back. But my experience was so so good with me living with five t-shirts five white t-shirt five marina two shots remember now you know vacation that you know and a crocs yeah man we don't need nothing more but guess what the problem is the sizes over there is kind of you know different i don't know what I was just confused. It was, a, it was a culture shock. Another thing that happened to me now is that I got sick on the ferry. Man. But my main thing was I enjoy myself without my suitcase. I enjoy myself without my suitcase. I survived. Some white t-shirt, you can't go wrong. Once Walmart is nearby, you can't go wrong. Can't go wrong with the Crocs. Crocs going on every water activity you can go in. You think of every water water activity you think of you can go in. I made to buy one um I made to buy one water shoes. So it worked out perfect. You see it, Rasta, they are you know, fake Rasta. But we are no fake, real. But we just like give thanks. See me? So this is my video of my experience of my luggage get left behind. So, like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell. So, when I post a video, you're first. Okay? Rasta there. Aile! Aile, aile. Yeah. Quite so.